The Brother Eye Print and Scan desktop app is the central hub for printing, scanning and monitoring device information for your Brother device, and it's free to download. This guide shows you how to get the most out of this free software with your Brother product. For a Windows PC, you will need to download and install Brother Eye Print and Scan desktop. If you have already installed the software, you can skip this step. Download Brother Eye Print and Scan from your product page on support.brother.com. Click Product Search. Enter your Brother device model number into the Search by Model Name field. For this video, we are using the MFC L3770 CDW. Your operating system should be detected manually. From there, click OK. Scroll down to the Utilities section. Click on Brother Eye Print and Scan, and then click on the End User License Agreement to start downloading. If you are using an Apple Mac OS X, you can download the software directly from the Apple App Store. Go to the Apple App Store and search for Brother Eye Print and Scan. Click Download, then Open. Make sure your Brother device is connected to your PC. If you are connecting via a network, make sure your Ethernet cable is connected, or if you are connecting via Wi-Fi, that you have completed the wireless setup. Alternatively, if you are using a USB connection, make sure your USB cable is connected to the machine and to your PC. After the download is complete, open the Brother Eye Print and Scan app. This is the Brother Eye Print and Scan software. As you can see, the user interface is clean and easy to navigate. In this video, we'll walk you through the settings so you can start using this software with your brother device. Firstly, you will need to select your brother device. On the right, click Select Your Machine. When your brother device is selected, the software will detect the features for your specific brother device, which you can see on the right-hand side. You can check the connection status, which shows you how your brother device is currently connected. The machine status will show you if your device is ready to print, if there are any error messages, as well as allowing you to keep an eye on the ink and toner levels. If one of your cartridges is running low, you can click on this icon to check the model number of the cartridge, making it easier for you to replace. The Brother Eye Print and Scan app allows you to print and scan documents and photos with your brother device. In this video, we'll focus on guiding you through the scanning features so you will see comprehensive options available for you to digitize your documents. We will also show you how to create workflows so you don't have to configure the settings every time you need to scan a document. Firstly, click on Scan. You will see the basic scan settings supported by your brother device. This might be document size, color settings, resolution, and single or two-sided scanning. There are also advanced settings if you need to adjust the image or page arrangement of your document. This includes skipping blank pages, de-skewing the document if it looks slanted, or rotating the document to portrait or landscape automatically. You are also able to adjust the quality of the image to enhance the brightness, contrast, or characters on black and white documents. Place the document into the auto document feeder or flatbed, and once you're ready, hit scan. Your document will appear on a preview screen. This preview screen allows you to adjust your document before saving or sharing it. You can add additional pages to your document by placing new pages into the auto document feeder. In the iPrint and Scan desktop app, click Scan. Once your document is ready, you can select to save the document to your PC or upload the document to cloud services like Dropbox, Google Drive or OneDrive. Once you select the Save or Share location, you can enter your preferred file name. Each file type will give you specific setting options related to that format. For example, if JPEG is selected, you are able to change the image quality, or if PDF is selected, you will see a different menu allowing you to select from a variety of PDF files. Next, you can select the folder you would like to save the document to and click Select Folder. Your document has now been saved. While you're still on the Saved Scan Data screen, you can also choose to save the same document to a cloud service 
or open the document in an application like Acrobat Reader. If you scan the same type of documents regularly and don't want to repeat the process every time, you can create a one-touch workflow. By creating a workflow, you can now scan a document using these settings without having to step through this configuration every time. And you can do this with one easy click. Save your scan settings and also save your file settings. Then select the One Touch Workflow option and then enter a workflow name. This is how you can quickly scan documents, create workflows and keep an eye on the status of your Brother product. If you have a Brother device, make sure you are using this free software and if you need assistance, reach out to us at our website.